What do you reckon? Is washing up like mental health? Have you seen how disgustingly built up this lot of washing up is? And you know what? Every day I could see it was building up and I still kept using a little bit of an extra fork, a little bit of an extra knife, and I'm not at the end of my tether with it yet. I do have a fork or two left. However, I knew that I needed to do something to combat this. So, just like mental health, I've decided to action it. First of all, I'm gonna put it into sections, into manageable chunks that I can actually manage. So, there we go, we're gonna do cutlery first and cups next. I know that I'm not gonna be able to solve everything straight away. There's gonna be some dirty stains on there, some kind of mental health issues that I can't shift. So actually, I might need to leave some things in soak for a little while. Even if it's only overnight, that's absolutely fine. I'm not managing to fix it all at once. And you know what, when I've actually cleared all this, I know my washing up is going to build back up again, but it's okay. Hopefully next time I will recognise before it's getting too much and too overbearing and maybe I'll be able to tackle smaller chunks at a time. And whilst I'm doing all that, I know that Biscuit, my little deaf dog, is going to be supporting me in the background, probably snoozing, but I know that in her sleep she'll be wishing me good thoughts. So, is your mental health like your washing up? Are you going to let it pile up or are you going to tackle it bit by bit? Happy washing up!